Ford Maverick Hybrid, a practical and fuel-efficient option for the modern truck enthusiast. In the world of trucks, the body-on-frame construction has long been regarded as the epitome of ruggedness and authenticity. Available in three trims, XL, XLT and Lariat. But no matter the model, its cabin dovetails nicely with the exterior. Hybrid technology further enhances its practicality. Unlike plug-in hybrids that require external charging, the Maverick's battery is recharged through regenerative braking and the gas engine. Enjoy the benefits of hybrid efficiency without the hassle of finding charging stations or plugging in their vehicle. This powertrain is mated to an electronic continuously variable transmission, ECVT, which utilizes gear drives instead of belts, enhancing durability and efficiency. One of the standout features of the Maverick Hybrid is its exceptional fuel economy. While the interior of the Maverick may appear understated, it offers a practical and comfortable cabin for everyday use. Create your own bike racks, segmented storage spaces and more using 2x4 and 2x6 boards in the vertical and horizontal slots. The Ford Maverick Hybrid challenges the traditional notion of what constitutes a real truck by offering a practical and fuel-efficient option for truck enthusiasts. So, if you're in the market for a versatile and eco-friendly truck, the Ford Maverick Hybrid deserves serious consideration. That's why the Maverick is the best-selling compact pickup today. Two years ago when my 2003 Subaru Baja that I drove for 15 years finally went kaput, I really wanted a Ford Maverick pickup truck, but they were not released yet. So I had to pre-order. So December 2021, I made an appointment at Coons Ford in Falls Church, Virginia to make an order. I showed up, they said, I'm sorry, Mr. Pepler, but we have stopped taking orders. However, I've got some good news. Someone just canceled. And if you like, you can take over his order. For me, that was a no-brainer. So I pre-selected everything that I wanted. I chose the cyber orange color uh, for an extra $500. Uh, spray and bed liner, full-size spare tire. And I chose the XLT trim. The total price point, um, including destination charge, was about 27000 Great deal for a pickup truck. And the, the way that uh, Ford can keep these trucks inexpensive um, is the only compact pickup truck that's built in the Americas. Um, all the parts are manufactured in the U.S. and they're assembled in Mexico. Um, everything is a unibody. Um, if you look at the interior, Everything seems very um, inexpensive. They look like things that you would purchase from a dollar store. Very rubberized. Um, and therefore, it was this incredible deal that I couldn't resist. Well, summer of 2022 came. I was waiting for my order. And then, lo and behold, the news from Ford came out that they were just inundated with orders. And also because of the uh, chip shortage coming from China, they could not deliver any more orders. So the vast majority of the orders that were made around my time were all canceled. Um, but Ford said, here's what we can offer you. We can offer you a rebate of $3,250 if you make a new order for 2023. So I did that. But then when I made the appointment at the dealership, they informed me that I was not eligible for this rebate. Why? Because of some technicality. Because I actually did not make my own order. I took over someone else's who canceled. And because of that, they wouldn't give it to me. Of course, I was disappointed, but I really wanted the Maverick. I already waited eight months. So I made the order for this year and then Waited and waited. No updates from the dealership, no emails from Ford, nothing. I had no idea when the truck would be ready, if at all. Lo and behold, a month ago, um, I got a 
phone call from the dealership and said, your Maverick is, has arrived. And I was like, oh, wow. I wasn't ready for that. I was getting ready to go out of country. And thank goodness I was still in town. So the very next day I showed up uh, to pick up my Maverick. Um, and then we negotiated. I said, can you please give me this rebate? Because I waited 18 months for this truck, faithfully. And they said, okay, we'll give you the rebate. However, part of the negotiation, I took their financing at 6.1% with Ally Financial, and we threw in all the extended warranties. The way I figured out the extended warranty for six years and 75,000 miles, that was actually not bad of a deal considering the fact that when inflation, the part, the prices for maintenance and repairs are going through the roof. Um, if I'm gonna use it, I, it's not a bad deal. So I, I took it and the and total package cost about $32,000. Still a very affordable price for a great pickup truck. That And today's the first day that I've owned this truck. I've driven around and I'm just amazed at how well it handles, the way it drives, you know, better than any other pickup truck I've ever driven. Um, it drives just like a Ford Escape Hybrid. Um, it's kind of like that, except it has the bed in the back. It's a very small bed. However, it's very versatile and it's actually exactly what I need as a homeowner. You know, I'm not carrying large amounts of uh, material or anything that's too gigantic that won't fit in there. Um, and, it, and, and then of course, um, the great deal that I found out because it gets 42 miles per gallon in the city. Washington DC only charges me a 2% excise tax as opposed to a 6.5% because it gets under 40 miles per gallon. And it's because of, of the hybrid. It's very economical um, and it's just a great deal, very efficient. Right now I'm sitting in the truck. I have the AC on, but the engine is not on because the AC is powered by the lithium ion battery. It's amazing. And, and the great thing about this hybrid is I don't have to plug it in. So it regenerates when I break. Um, it's exactly when I want it. It's very versatile and it's really practical and it's really pertinent to my lifestyle. So I'm extremely happy that I got this Maverick and I hope to continue using it and continue to be very pleased with what Ford has built.